final match of the CB Rivals third place playoff, which is Blame Elias versus Eden. Eden will get the left side. Technically, the attack inside and the hero deaths and you are out. So you don't want to be over committing too much here this time around. Um, what do you guys think it's going to go to then here with this one? Um, I already called it being an Eden's final. I said Eden would win it. Um, already and that was my singly from the very get-go so i'm sticking with that for me uh what do you guys think i mean i i'm sticking with blame elias to win i reckon after those two last matches as well they'll be very happy with that um it's gonna be close though it's gonna be very close. Bu arada, Bu arada bence klaslar I mean, çok I'm, fark I'm edecek. Bu arada, I, I recognize a lot of those names. I've seen those guys play their hearts out. Blame Elias are definitely a talented bunch, but I'm definitely uh, going with Eden here as the, my prediction. Uh, they're just guys. Reebok definitely knows the guys are strats out. Ghost X definitely knows how to make some calls. Match is in there as well. Got more Fufu on there as well, doing some specialty plays. You know, I've seen her do some crazy stuff. So I definitely think they have a really strong team and they can come back from this and uh, finish strong here. We'll have to see them. W. All right, time to go. Third place final, third, fifth match, fifth game, final match. It's up to you guys. Rocket. Okay, here we are underway. It's going to be an interesting one because there's a lot more pikes here on the side of E. Yeah, Elias have got more cav by the looks of them. Elias do have a lot more cav than Eden do. CBL. Holy smoke. These yeah. unit counts are interesting for Grasslands, man. A lot of infantry on this field for oh, a field battle, yeah. man. A whole ton. Should be a really I'm juicy fight. Surprised by it. Blame Elias definitely bringing a good amount of cap compared to uh, Eden here, in my opinion. Um, I expected more jab caps. Jab cap, jab cap's not banned either. I'm surprised there's not more jab cap on the field. Um, oh, jab yeah, cap is just kind of stupid. I'm kind of surprised I don't see everyone with at least one set of jab cap. Had. Very jab cap on Elias' side, they've got like three units of it as well, and the attack, uh, the attack, yeah. Eden, the attacking team, have got like maybe eight sets. I think I've seen. Hmm. I reckon the plan is from Elias's though, they've got quite a lot of Madawa at the beginning. I reckon that they're going to go B, and then they're going to send their cav like to maybe, from their side it must be A's that they're like, if you like, their flag. Yeah, I feel like, I always find the Grasslands, the guys that are on the attack, always have the advantage. It's not meant to be, it might be pretty fair, but I always feel that Grasslands always has a, an advantage to the attackers, just because the way you spawn in at the very start, C and B are pretty close to each other in comparison to A, a and, B. and uh, yeah. B. So, mm. I, it's going to be interesting to see what uh, what they do here from it. Um, obviously, B is the most important part of the whole the whole map, because the flanks, you can grab one of them. They're going to win it as well. He's doing a massive rush here to C point right away, bringing over seven heroes by the looks of it. Does not look like Eden's responding whatsoever to it. They're definitely focusing B side here, like Mark is saying. But, but uh, that A push is also looking like an even trade right now. But a really heavy death ball here by Blame Elias. They're going to go straight from C to that supply point. Really good strat by that, but I do say so myself. You guys yeah, might be definitely in the right here for that push. I think yeah. the problem what Elias is going to have here, though, <laughs> is when they take A and B now, their end point's going to be open, and there's such a big death ball from Eden in the middle that they can push straight for the end base. And blame Elias yeah, all on the wrong side of the map. Blame Elias all the way, the other way. Right. If you look at the back, though, Pans are sitting back there right now with some infantry watching the home point in case this plan does not work. They did they did have some slight dash, so they do have a guy watching that back line up there. But right now, they're just hoping to win that exchange on A, which doesn't look like they are. It looks like currently a 2v2 will you want to unfolding with his. Zenga and Ghost X trying to mm. trying to get involved as well there, um, but if, if, if one last does take this, they're currently sitting on their home point. All they need to do is win yeah. A, and Eden's going to get smoked out. So Eden needs to win on A, 100%. which doesn't look like they are. Um, Ghost X is kind of sitting there in a circle with Jab Cav in a two v one. So if one last does pull, get that point, it's done. It's going to be done real quick here for Eden. Look at that one guy sitting back. They're all rotating back for B now. They're going to sandwich him, dude. Mister Drop is already on well, the home so... point waiting as well. He's waiting back there. Get yeah, that looks like he's gonna map there, but he's gonna have to yeah, pull away because like Asamaga yeah, Pepper Thor would respawn back in. And there's a big bro going on. on he's eventually well. gonna get taken now. That's the, it's only Ghost X as a hero left. Funny time we didn't have any units left. Or get the advantage here going towards the home point. Um, but in terms of hero wise, the the Eden have lost three heroes in comparison to um what I uh, can blame Alias have just now on the on the actual fights. So. They're winning these matchups and winning these fights against well, the heroes. Holy shit! Yeah, it's gonna it's it's turning around here a little bit. 
Um, it's definitely been some turnarounds right now. Currently, Eden has a couple guys on their back line watching for defensive plays. They've really got a hold B here. It might even get triple capped. I have to say, Eden's definitely it does not seem to have advantage of this fight right now. It definitely looks like Wayne Elias is kind of muscling at this point in time based off the unit counts. Um, yep. If Elias don't have an opening to go for the end base as well, all they well all they have to do all they have to do is sit and wait now because the, the team that has both caps at the end of the at the end of the match. If none of them nobody's going to move, do that, don't be win. crazy. <laughs> You They're going to go though. straight for B point. They're going to go straight know. for B point. Oh, right. Two guys could go for a triple cap here and get that 5% difference. I mean, it's literally happening right now. There's Namiyo only one behind that. Then, yep. Wow. Wow. Wow, yeah, Blade Wise might take this right here. There's only two there's only two eating on the point right now. They're trying to respond desperately, but it's not looking like Ghost X coming in hot with some cab, but I don't know if that's gonna be enough. I think I think Elias might get it here. This is a high possibility. They've got a lot of pikes. Maybe there as well. some definitely killing these heroes off quicker than they can get onto the point to protect it. Cap coming in yeah. from both sides here as well, and that's it's gonna CB, clear that muted. point here from them. CB's muted by the way. If you if you didn't wow. know there you go. Eden have just dropped to seven heroes as well. He is getting oh, capped, wow. and Eden are down to yeah, they're down to the numbers. So down to the eight, just now alive. As one just spawned in, oh, but they're all spawned at their home point, and they're going to get triple capped here. And time is well. going. That's the trip cap right there, ladies and gentlemen. That that's not good. That's not got good. It. It's definitely not the way you want to start your match. Oh up. no! You've got Lara oh, and the Alex and the C Pro defending C, and you've got the majority of the team on B, and then you've got Michak on A as well, so... Oh, shit. 80% in the corner. units everywhere, yep. It is going to be... Oh, no. Boy, has definitely come for some vengeance. They, 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 they yeah. want that third place prize, man. They ain't going down with that. They ain't going down easy. No, they're Eden's... definitely not. Either are pushing towards C point, though, to try and get that point back to stop that deteriorating... Uh, Elias are just going to things... filter in heroes though to stop them yep. capping as long as possible. The longer they can stop that cap, the better it works out for them. Blastoria not coming back, Mr. Talk and Uwe are coming oh back. Oh my as... god. Blame Elias, uh, Elias the Veggie are also here coming back as well. So they're definitely going to get stop that C point being capped completely. And Big keep got that well. points going. My god. Biggie survives wow. long enough to keep a lot of that pointage. But we are down to 29% here and it's going to be going down before. And there's only going to be 20% left. It can I swing around. It again. <laughs> they might literally just put them to zero percent. This is right here. This, could, this is definitely it. Actually, as a matter of fact, it definitely is. They don't have enough time to cap it back. That's nah, it, guys. That's, that's, it. It. that's over. That is game. Holy this crap. is game. And it is oh definitely over God. with. Blame Alias. Brought out more cav. And you said it already is out of the very start. Oh my God. Eden dude. had an infantry stack here. And an infantry stack <laughs> oh, did not win them the grasslands. I know. Eden. And it's over. Eden has got full rotated here. They got... <laughs> Would you believe it? Go that, was... <laughs> that was the complete turnaround. You go from being 2-0 up with that match point advantage to get completely swung around the other way around and it goes in the way of Blame Elias. That is wow. madness. <laughs> just shows you. Look at the analysis as well. Like it literally went one way for a bit and then it went the other way and then it just... Wah. Yep. Mental. Absolutely. That was that was a great strategy from Blake Mills. I thought maybe by going full C and trying to rotate around, if they capped A, it would be important to get the home point. But instead of that, they managed to whittle the down the units and the numbers, get both points, and then push towards B to get the triple cap. And the triple cap, when you've got that, the time goes so quickly. Um, you have to get people on and off that point, and they were rotating their cap quicker than the units of infantry from Eden, and you just can't get back in time quick enough. There wasn't enough. Uh, Cavalry for Eden to, to even help. Mm. Oh.